So you need you need flyers to be able to translate your ideas into reality and communicate it to others to drive that movement you want to create. You want to invite people to join a class. You want to invite people to join your program. You want to invite people to learn about something that is going on. You need a flyer. Yes, you might not be a graphic artist or whatever. I'll just show you some simple tricks that you need to have behind your mind or your, have in your head when you are going about creating your flyer. I also talked about your logo, that you are a brand. Once you have a name, you are a brand. Uh, Wasila Yakubu Akwe. There's a way you would, you would brand your name, give it a logo, and put it on your Facebook page or your Facebook account. Design a poster behind you or your Facebook or your Facebook wall, then put in your logo there. People might not know you by face, but when you start talking about maybe um, importance of digital education, for instance, as a topic, if that is the area you target and you keep talking about it on daily basis, you will have people, thousands of people that will just come to your page or your Facebook wall just to listen to you talk about digital education. Uh, somebody will say, where are you? You'll say, oh, I saw it on Wasila Yakubo Akwe page, Facebook page. You are now a brand. The Wasila Yakubo Akwe that your classmates in secondary school, primary school know about is not different from the one that is on Facebook because the one on Facebook now is a celebrity, it's a brand. At that point, nobody can even use your name. You can register it and trademark it. If I ask you today, can you go and say you want to use a name, Didier Drogba? It's already a brand. You know when you say Didier Drogba or JJ Okocha? You know when you say your, your, your name is JJ Okocha, they will look at you. You know how to play football. Then it means you are fake. <laughs> but that is not a brand. So you need logo to push your brand. You need flyers to translate your idea into reality. The next topic we are going to learn briefly, without wasting much time too, is the use of Google Drive to create forms. The other thing you can achieve using Google Drive is that you can actually use it for survey. I will show you where you can get, use it to interpret your results when doing survey. So you don't really need papers to go around doing survey. Just create a Google form and all that. Now, if you have a community you've created, like you were taught how to create a WhatsApp group yesterday and a broadcast list, please and please, after this training, go back and watch the videos or go back on to YouTube. How do I create a Facebook? How do I create a broadcast list? Look, let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, as long as you can read and write, as long as you are in the academic environment, you need to prepare yourself to be able to become a mentor, a leader for a lot of people that need to follow you, asking questions about some academic issues. And that's why you need a WhatsApp group. So you might end up having 1,000 persons in your WhatsApp group. What are they doing there? They are following you. They are following Nafisa Alakai. They ask you questions, how do I get admission? What course should I read? If I finish this course, what where can I work? You might not get the answer. You might have friends that can give you the answers. You might go to ChatGPT. You might go online, get the answer, send it there. You saw somebody's problem. Now you have people following you. Is it an easy thing to have 1,000 people in your WhatsApp group listening to you? It's not an easy thing. Some of these persons will grow up to become lecturers, doctors, lawyers, some people presidents, governors. They will keep remembering you. Now, a very good example of what I'm trying to explain is this. If you take your mind back to secondary school, I'm sure you can still remember the name of that teacher. If I ask you, who can type the name of the most the, the, the most interesting teacher in secondary school? Just put the name of your teacher down and the subject. That mine was a geography teacher, Mr. Mwasoro. Actually finished from Padopas. He taught me geography and I liked the man so much that I wish I could still meet the man. Who is that teacher? To you, just type the name of the teacher. So you begin to see 
the essence of why you need to learn how to do flyer, poster, logo, you know you have to use your WhatsApp group, you know how to use, have a Facebook page to give you like a signboard, like a poster, like a, an office, your Facebook page account or whatever you're using, it becomes like your office where people go to see everything you're doing, your Twitter, your LinkedIn and all that. Those are places where people go to see who you are. Where your WhatsApp is like the room or the classroom or where you are keeping your people who are listening to you. Anytime you want to talk to them, go there and put it. I can see that nobody has posted the name of his or a teacher in secondary school. Oh, really? Let Mr. Ubang, Ubangari, my English teacher. Wow. You see? You see? You see? See, Aisha Lawa. See, Mustafa Umar Baku. Mine too is a geography teacher. Let me say, don't, can you imagine? But we do call him nature. You see, and I'm sure you liked him so much. Kopa Emanuel, chemistry teacher, you see? Wherever Kopa Emanuel is, now you're still calling him Kopa Emanuel. He's actually no longer a Kopa. Maybe probably you, you, you left secondary school years ago, but you still call him Kopa. I'm sure even if you see him today, you say Kopa Emanuel, but you remember him as Kopa. And he has left the mark on you. Deborah, you see, uh, Mrs. Iduma Jogyo, okay, Professor Philippus Dami, biology teacher, you see, the person is not even a professor, Mr. Ode, India, geography, oh, we have, there are so many of us here that like our geography teachers, Mr. Dahol, Agri, Agri. Professor Zainab, uh, Alkali, literature professor, wow, I'm sure you're talking about university. I'm even, even talking about secondary school. But it's still okay, university is okay. Mine is Mr. Atewase, our literature teacher. Okay, my literature teacher is uh, Mr. Sylvester. Yeah, right there in Makodi. Charles Yombe, literature teacher, good. Anna Draja, biology, wow. So that is, you can see, you can see. You can see the names you guys are bringing up. Now, how do you feel when you remember your teacher? How, how will you feel or how do you see yourself being remembered by others? Your teacher probably never had the digital advantage you have now, having a WhatsApp class, being able to create a Google phone where all of all of you can have you can have your data. And you will, by now, all of you would have been doing WhatsApp. My teachers never had that opportunity. But you have it. If your volume is not on, just click, click those, that microphone button on your left, tap it on and off. You also check, if you're using your phone, check your audio. You see? So, uh, whichever, today you have that opportunity to have thousands of people following you as students, as trainees, as mentees that they want to listen to you. You can just choose a line to be talking about biology. You can choose a line. You see, Mary Norma Christopher, I had a class, an English teacher, and his brand name is Whereas. You know? So these are things you know, you, you, you live, they, dead or alive, you keep remembering. In your case, you can even you don't have the opportunity of even creating Google form to collect their data. You have a WhatsApp group to keep them. You have a Facebook page for them to go and see what you are posting, your video, your pictures. And that is how it works. So your training, your digital training you are doing here, don't think you are just going to learn how to use WhatsApp, how to use a uh, Google Drive, how to use uh, uh, Facebook, all these kind of things. I know all those things, but the point is that you probably have not linked all the dots. For those of you doing marketing, it brings you home to what we call integrated digital marketing. You advertise with your WhatsApp, your Facebook, people go there, like it, and they click on the link, they land on your WhatsApp, then you are talking about a program or a, a course, you talk about or an event and you give them further information about the event on your WhatsApp when they land there from your Facebook page. And now 
you bring them to Zoom and you talk to them on Zoom. And when they are through, you give them your Google form, they fill it, and you have their data, and you can message them on WhatsApp, on uh, email, or send them SMS. They can even decide to say, I'm giving you certificates for attending my program. Now, you can see how you've connected all this. You created your flyer with your logo, you put it on your Facebook page, you advertise it, you share it, your friends help you to share it. You might even want to boost it. And people go to your Facebook page, like what you've posted, click on the link, come to your WhatsApp, you talk to them on your WhatsApp, you teach them on your WhatsApp, just the way we are going about it right now. Then when they are through, you collect their data with Google Form, and you send them a thank you message, send them a certificate, or send them whatever you want to say. And you also have their record. So that next time somebody say, I did a course with you, say, oh, really? That's true. And they should also have your record. Ladies and gentlemen, do you feel more excited now learning everything you've been learning for the past two days? Let me hear your comment here on the comment section. Then we'll move ahead. I want to see your comment. You feel excited now. You feel more energized. You feel you now have more reasons why you should study all these things. Thank you, Jacob Sunday. Thank you, Mustafa. Thank you, Sylvia Kotombo. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. You see, that is Joseph. So you are now operating at a different level from every other person because it's, you are operating at a level of knowledge, a level of exposure, and a level where you now know that, oh, some things are possible I never knew were possible. And once you now know, start seeing some things being possible, you start dreaming of bigger things. Your university environment starts booming with, with positive vibes. You, you know, everybody bouncing around because everybody now knows something that is, was not really possible. That is just it. Okay, one of, the, one of the things we are really going to do very soon is to see how we can promote our university Facebook page is going to be part of the assignment we're going to carry out practically. I will see the response. You know, uh, people need to know more about uh, investing. With the knowledge you're getting here, you should be able to promote a brand. Your investment is a brand. The department sponsoring this program is a brand. No, okay. Yes, the volume should be from your end. My volume is okay. Xiaomi. 231 is the name of a phone. I don't know. The training is very educative. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Everybody. Okay, let's move now straight to business. Let's create a flyer and create a logo. Let's not overload ourselves with too much information. You have all the days, all the months, all the years. Go to YouTube and watch videos. We have videos too on our channel. This, I sent some links to you on the, uh, the class platform. Go back to the class. Click on those links our Twitter, our YouTube, our Facebook, join all of them and be connected to us so that you will be having opportunities to get information that can be transforming you. And especially the Telegram group. Make sure you join the Telegram group so that you have a problem. Just post it there. Somebody will be there, is there to respond to you. Thank you. Okay. So, um, first of all, we are going to post up to use post on my wall. Uh, this post on my wall, and uh, this is my own post on my wall. I've been using for quite some time. Uh, if you see, I have so much here, so much I've been doing, so much. See, yeah, so much. It keeps going and going and going and going. And going. You see that that everything I've been doing for years, they're all here. So I can always go back and fetch them. Now, I, I don't intend to go to sign out. 
But if you are creating an account here, if you want to create an account, for instance, you click here um, and you log out, it will ask you to log in again. Once you log, once you create an account, you can actually create your flyers or anything without creating an account. But the advantage of creating an account is that you are going to have this, this, this one here, my stuff. What my stuff means is that everything you've been doing, they are all here. So you can always come and check. Yes. You can also partner with someone and connect with somebody to work on it. Okay. To better, you can create all manner of flyers. Let me give you an instance. I want to. Um, sorry. Yeah, for those of you that want to do. Um, sorry. That's not what I want. Okay. If you want to create a flyer, for instance, I want to create. Um, corporate flyer. So one thing I just need to advise you, if you are coming here for the first time, or first of all, don't create any flyer. Use it three, four, five days or a week to go through, try your hands, understand why some parts are moving, some parts are not moving, and try to understand it. And after that, you come and try. If you are not artistically inclined, you don't have so background knowledge on Google or no, uh, uh, correct draw or designs or digital designs like that. Please, my advice for you is this, and very, very important is that stick to the design you you have. Now, you are seeing the designs here. You like it. Stick to that design. Don't try to do too much changes on the design because you are still learning. Okay. Now, when you Type any, for instance, you can just type a corporate flyer. Or let us say flyers. Other flyers will come out. Are you following? If you are following, please just type yes, please. Okay, these are other flyers that are coming out. So you can see them. So if you are pastors, you can do your flyers here for your church service. If you are a teacher, you can do your flyers here to get students to take more courses with you. I um, mean, to secondary school teacher, if you are a non-academic, if you have a business you are doing, you can actually market yourself with this and put it online. You don't need to go far. Now, you don't need anybody and you don't need to go far. Just work on it yourself. Okay, you can see. So let's look for a very simple one. To, to uh, Okay, let's look for a restaurant flyer, restaurant flyer. Yes, so that we can quickly try our hand on something. Okay. This is post time award. Don't worry, I will send you the link. I will send you the link. Yeah. So what do you mean by yes, but for the first time? Techno BF. Put your message there, let me see. But please don't skip typing message and miss this class. Okay. Um, restaurant flyer. Let me search. Okay. So let me put something like uh, restaurant. Restaurant. French we call it a restaurant. Okay. So uh, this uh, beautiful flyers. Now, if you see anyone like this, just know that it has videos. You can see it has videos. You can actually put the music. Let me let me do something. Let's try our hands on this. This. Let me give you a very funny story where I'm showing you what to do. Some years back, several years back, I would ask somebody in Katna to do flyers for me. And uh, sometimes I get to say, okay, I'll pay you later. I have not finished what I'm doing. And he gets angry. Sometimes we have issues. 
not being patient to one for me to pay him when he wants payment, one or things like that. And it passed on like that. And I felt no, I can't continue with that kind of uh, embarrassment. I need to get something for myself. So I went and I searched, and that was how I stumbled on post my work. Nobody else really taught me how to use post my work. I stumbled into it, I found it myself. I, I knew I needed it to survive in this life. So I did everything possible to study it, and I got it. And guess what? I started seeing some of the flyers that guy did for me. And he was charging me 5000 10000 7000 The list was 3000 I saw all of them here, and there were things I could do for free for myself. Not talk about cases where you even delay. Okay. Now, um, see, this flyer has videos. A video. You can see each time I move my mouse. Remember I told you you can only do this with a laptop. Yes. So you can go sit in the cafe. Every one hour, just go and spend time and learn some things. Please, this is not a time for you to do things conveniently. This is time for you to discomfort yourself to prepare for your tomorrow. You can see all this. So what it simply means is that if I put my cursor here, I can move and hold it down, I can move this. Okay? So buy now. So instead of, let me just do something. Instead of dollar sign, I can just put N. That's Naira. 25K only. Hmm? 25K only. I did a the sell for 25K. But let's just assume this one is 25k. Okay. Then anytime you put your cursor and click on it and leave your mouse after clicking, it will bring this box. This one by the side means you can pull it down like this. Why this one means you can pull it straight. Then this one by the side means you can expand it. Like if I pull it, it's expanding. I can pull it back and it contracts. Okay. Yeah. So buy now, 25K only. And I can change this to actually this box here. You will need to study your hand to be this box. Let's see. Some people are busy typing on there. Please don't bother yourself about the software. I will give you the name. Okay, I will give you the name. Mm, okay, just so, a minute. Yeah. So I want to okay, let's keep it simple. Now this is bugger. We can change changes to something else. If you come here, see, I can move this around. I want to change the color around it from you come to your right hand side, you see this red color around it. You can change it to maybe blue. I change it to blue. Okay. And this burger, I can change the color to. Yeah. It's white. Let me change it to yellow. So our burger has turned to yellow. So if you hold down your pusho, depending on where you hold, and that's why you don't need to be in a hurry. You need to know what you're doing. Okay. So we can change this to uh, full Lafia restaurant. <laughs> okay. Let me change this. I just highlighted this. And come here and type. Uh, I want to change the the font. You see fonts. I come here and change it to Roberto. Okay. Click back on it. Like I remember, I told you you can make it smaller by the middle size, or just come here to reduce the size. 
Please, you cannot learn everything this evening. Make out time to go and practice further on your own. Okay? So, let me make it bigger. Yeah. You see? That's it. Okay, I want to add a logo. Okay, let me finish this. Delivery is my number. Zero nine zero nine one six one twenty. That is it. Monday food drinks all that. Okay, I want to do something. I want to add my a logo to it, so I can just come here and put a You can see that I'm not joking, huh? Okay. Yeah. So this is my logo, and uh, I wanted to speak somewhere. You will know that. Okay. This is the logo of the restaurant owner. Or oh, let me put it here. I can still revisit a bit. Let's see. This is a bit. Okay. So now I want to change the logo, the color, and everything. I said remove the color and make this one bright. Yes. Contrast. So that gives me my logo. So you play around everything you want to do. So now I remember I told you this one has a video. And then you can actually play the video. So it's playing, you can see. Please, are you, if you are with me, you just type yes. If you are with me, just type yes. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. I'm sure you have started dreaming of so many things you can do now. You never knew you could do. Yeah? <laughs> Don't worry. Hold on to Mrs. Kaju. Tell her, Madam, this man must come to Lafia. Come and teach us face to face how to do this flyer. It is something that can transform your life forever. Your wife can be doing her business online while you are working in the West as a lecturer or as a non academic star. But your wife is online marketing your products with beautiful flyers, bringing her flyers every day. Or your husband to be that one doing it while you're working invested in whichever way. So it simply means that you have not even started. So don't complain that Nigeria is bad. When you when you know some things, you know that Nigeria is not really as bad as we are thinking. You only just need is that information and knowledge. And you are beginning to see a little, little exposure of it. Okay, so now let me add music to this. Uh let me see. A lot of things are changing every day here. Uh, it's used to come with its music background, but I will have to research that. Don't worry about that. The last time I thought it, it wasn't there like this. There was a place for you to just select any music you want. Okay, don't worry about the music. I will um, get it. I will get it. And then tell you how you can do that. Okay, I think we can get, okay. I think we can get some here. So that's one thing you also need to understand. You need to keep updating yourself on daily basis otherwise you will just discover that uh, otherwise you will discover that you are not current see just a few days out of tune with this 
and they are now discovering they are no longer correct. Okay. Let's see if we have our flyer. Wow. So that's that. Uh, the length of the music and other things you can actually work work on it. Um, let's try some things here. You can come here intro animation. You can just put um, there are so many ways you can come in. Okay. Now, there's something, this is not a video anyway, this is just a flyer with music. There's something you need to understand. It's what we call watermark. Watermark shows that this video was done by Poster My Wall and that um, you have not paid for it. My, me, I have paid anyway, I paid per year. But you might see it down here. So what you do is that... Uh, you can use it like that. And if you don't want it to show, you pay. And it's cheaper when you pay for a month or for a year, but you can pay for a picture or you just leave it like that for free. Some people just crop up this part. Do all their designs of the up here and crop up this part. So it depends on you or whatever you want to do. Some people just use it with the, with the watermark there. But that is now up to you to discover and how you want to go about it. So let me download this. So it's coming as MP4. I can also decide to download it as JPEG instead. But I want it as MP4, so I'm going to download it. I can also work on the size. So we'll go and quickly do another a, a simple flyer. Well, time has really gone. So you can actually do other flyers without adding music. We just work on the ones without music. So it's the same principle. Hold on your cursor, pull it, close it, double click on it, and edit the text. And like I said, stay close to the design. Don't change it until you are very, very comfortable using it. So it's taking time to, time to download because it's um, It has the music. So the next we are going to do is uh, we're going to look at poster my wall. I mean uh, Google Drive. But before then, I'll quickly put you out to do your logo. But please, for the sake of time, all the things are already in the video I sent to the class. Do yourself a favor too to go and watch these videos and forever remain smiling because you've learned something that you know one thing leads to the other. Once you just understand some things, you start triggering a lot of positive changes in your life, your business, how you do things, and how you look at it. Yeah.
Just be patient, please. Okay, so not there. Okay, so I'll save this as bugger on my desktop. And um, let me quickly go to my desktop so that I'll see what we have there. So we have our bugger here. It's gonna play now. That is our logo. Let's quickly go and uh, see if we can. Uh, okay, let me see. Yeah, the network is so bad. Don't worry, don't worry. Uh, if the network is bad for you, others, it's good for others, but you will get the recorded version. Okay, good. So let's go to uh, this. Um, Okay, how do you feel? You like what you got and what you're seeing? I want to see your comments. You like what you got and what you're seeing? You can do this all by yourself. Yeah. You don't need anybody to, and you don't need to stop paying for anybody to do that for you. You can do that by yourself. There are thousands of thousands of thousands of flyers there, templates you can use. And you know what? Make up your mind what you want to do before you get there because you might spend the whole day looking at all the templates and you'll not be able to do even one. Because you'll be, you'll be confused. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Let's go back and create a logo for ourselves quickly. So that we can look at Google Drive, then we'll call it a day, then we'll rest for tomorrow. But while you are resting for tomorrow, please be trying out your plans on a lot of things. Okay. Just a minute, think. Uh, okay. Okay.
Okay. Um, let's quickly go and create our logo. I'm done with this. I'm going to create a logo. Now, there are thousands of logos here, and you can just edit anyone. For those of us that are Christians, let's use this for instance. So, okay, let, I know we also have Muslims, so let's look some, for something neutral. Um, let's uh, look at. Um, okay, let's take this for instance. There are. We want to edit this and make it our logo. So we can come here and change this, change this to ash color or maybe purple. Aha, okay. Then we can change this to red, keep dark red. Come back here and make it dark red. Then you see, we can call this one full lafia. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. I can call it full lafia. But this is just for uh demonstration purpose. Though. So please don't go and say full lafia now has a logo. Okay. So we can change this to be full lafia. Lafia, okay, FL. So let's pull it down, then pull it like this. You have to go and discover a lot of things yourself too. But you know this is possible. So I will hold this one down again, pull it down, position it very well, then I'll type the home for the best. Okay, then, like I told you before, at the middle, at the angle like this, I hold it down and pull it out to make it bigger. Or you just go and, uh, yeah. We can also make it space, space the letters to be wider. But if you come here, for instance, under letter spacing, you can space it, you see, it's getting bigger. So if I pull this and pull it back, it gets smaller. Then hold it and extend it, it gets bigger. So I can still space it again so that yeah. So the design changes and the way it looks changes. Always remember to centralize to make sure everything is accurately laid. They are aligning. See, home for the best. So maybe we can change this. I don't think I really like this color much. So we can change it to. Blue, that blue, okay. Make this one bigger. And you can even change the color of this one to be maybe uh, red. Yes, you can see red. Let me do something. I want to make this, I want to duplicate it. Just copy and V, paste. So control V, copy and control V, paste. Now the one on top, which is this one, I will leave it to be red. But this one that is going to be behind, I want to make it white. Okay? Then all I just need to do is either reduce this one just by a tiny bit. See? Then put it on top. Remember, you can use your, your arrow keys. On your laptop to move them. So it has given us another design. And we'll come here and change this one to ash color and change this one to, <clears throat> no, just like that. This one can be yellow or whatever. So we have our design. If I click on Control A, if you copy everything, I hold it down to this angle, like I used to tell you. Pull it down, and it can get bigger. If I hold it side, pull it again, it can even get bigger. <clears throat> Remember, you see all highlighted. I can put my cursor in the middle, 
pull it down and I can shift everything to the middle. I will have our logo. Now let's decide, let's download our logo. That's JPEG. Yeah, it's downloading. Okay. That's downloaded. Of course, see it as logo. And then um, that's that. So let's go and see our logo. How it looks like. That's our logo. You like it? Is it not fine? So you can go and check for any logo there and play with any of the logo. Yeah. Okay. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are through with that. I will send you the link to the class. I will send the link to the class. The ball is now in your court to go and explore, explore it, and that's it. So, go and do your own logo right now after the class. Okay. Do we go ahead to talk about Google Drive? How to create a form? Should we quickly look at how to create a form, a Google form, though the video is there already? Okay, if I have a lot of people saying yes, I will teach you how to do that. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, let me go and uh, start that now. Okay. If you have any question, please feel free to ask. Any question, just type your question, please. Or raise up your hand and ask a question. I will take questions from just two persons so that we can meet up. Just two persons. Questions, please. Just raise up your hand. Indicate. Okay, I think nobody is asking any question. Please don't be shy. I understand that you are from the same community. Of, ah, this man self, he doesn't even understand this simple thing. He's asking question. Please, this is about you, about you and yourself. Don't even look at the next person beside you. Learn it very well. You might be the one to be training others on how to use it later on. Okay, so let's move ahead to Google Drive. Before I Put on the screen. Google Drive is a place, if I ask you, most times people say Google Drive is for collecting data. Yes. I told you before you cannot use your phone. Please use, use, um, use, uh, what is it called? Um, your laptop. Okay. Abdullahi, you are still asking with software. I said I'm going to send all these things. This is when, this is why when we are on Zoom, a lot of people don't pay attention. They just keep their screen there and they are doing something else. And they keep asking the same question. We've said it over. We're going to send a link for you to use in the class. Can you help me demonstrate how to add background music to the flyer? My network interrupted. It's recorded. You can watch it later. Okay, and um, Balaga, like this, you can watch it later. It's recording. Okay. So let's move ahead. So Google Drive is something that you need to learn. Actually, that you're a lecturer, you are not academic staff, you are doing business, you can teach your wife, teach your husband, teach your younger ones. 
you tells you to collect data, tells you to interpret data. You can even upload your books there and make it like send out the link and people can be reading your book and even add a short text to it. Wow. You can do a lot with Google Drive. But because of time, we might not get to be. Google Drive is divided into nine stages. Nine. But we might not be able to get to that point. We might just get to one, two, three, or one or so, which is still very, very massive for you. For you to get to nine, we need to do it face to face, and it's going to be time consuming, and you need to give it all the attention it deserves. And after learning it, you need to keep using it, otherwise, you will lose it again. But for now, let's just do what we know we can use every day. Okay, let's go to our screen. For you to use Google Drive, you must have a Gmail. No two ways about it. You must have a Gmail. And for you to use uh, Gmail, you need to create an account for Gmail. Now, I don't know about you. I use Gmail. And I encourage you to use Gmail. I also have a Facebook, I mean, Yahoo anyway. Yeah. Okay, so this is my Gmail. And if you copy your Gmail, like I told you, please don't bother to use your phone. You have Google Drive on your phone, naturally. You have it. But it's going to be very, very strenuous using your phone to create this. So just relax. Let it with the laptop. Then you can do some editing, some corrections here and there with your phone. Okay, please don't look for shortcuts. You will not end up enjoying this and you abandon it. Meanwhile, all the benefits you would have derived from this, you also lose it. So do the right thing by getting to a business center to use it to learn. Just tell them you want to use 30 minutes and just use it to practice following this video. You, have, you can be watching the video right on the business center or with your phone while you're doing this. Okay, if you click here, you'll see that you have some apps here. It's there, you have it there to they just watch this. You come here, click this. You are going to create a form. And that form is like inviting people. Okay, we are creating a form to, to create a quiz for our students. So now I want to create a new form. Just come here. But before I create that form, I want to show you some things. Uh, if you are going to watch the video in the class, that I posted in the class, please take note. All these places are document this is like microsoft word this is like google uh, excel sheet this is like powerpoint they all have the same features and they have templates you can use this google form this is where we are coming from so so we want to create a quiz and we'll use a blank one to create a quiz i mean i'm just going to ask just 10 simple questions the place know that when you create when you are creating a quiz you need to also set it. And when you are creating a Google form, there are things you need to quickly understand. For instance, the title. Full Lafia test class. Okay. Once you click here, it's put set. Now, this very one is what I will see if I'm looking for this form. This is where we're looking for the form. See, there are so many others. So I'll just see for Lafia. Okay. Then, this is what the students will see. Okay, so let me. So you can see Fulafia here, right? So I don't need to go far to look for it. So I'm looking for it and I just type Fulafia. Hmm? And it will just come up. That is because that is how I saved it. You can also create a folder for it that you can find out that later. That's not really much of a problem. So let's go ahead to create this form. And like I say, this form collects email and it's only through email or whatever you can use or Gmail, whatever. So this is the email the student is going to put because it's a quiz. You can also come now come to the setting 
We are making this a quiz. Yes, this is a quiz. Immediately release the grades after submission. Yes, once the student is through with the test, the student should see the score. Missed question. You want the student to see the base question. Usually, I want to check all this. And you can use it if you like. Then come here. The respondent has to put this in an email. If you want the student to get a copy of the response and everything, say yes. Just say yes, or when requested. Allow response editing, which means after the test, the student can edit the question. Normally, I'll say no. Then you can just say, okay, you can only limit it to just once so that the student can respond only once. So you can also put a progress bar. Now, when you say shuffle other questions, my number 10 will be your number 8. And will be the other person's number 7. The questions are shuffled. You can also shuffle the options in the questions, just like what Jam does. Now, when the person submits this, you may say, thanks from full Lafia. OK? So you save it. That's the message the person will get after submitting. And uh, So that is it. Other, other things, you, you can also do that yourself. Then come here, I want to create a sheet where um, I can see all the answers the students are pouring in. OK, so fine. So let's create our questions now, the questions. So first of all, I'll say, uh, I'll create a section. This section will talk about your details. You see, when you put your cursor up here and you click on the section, it will always come under. Anywhere you click your cursor, your section, your section will go under. Okay. Then, if you want to delete the section, just click here and say merge with above, and that's how you delete your or delete section. Yeah, whatever. So, just put here your details. I like it and make it bold. Okay. So the next thing you see here is full names. Come here. I've made it mandatory. Come here. Your phone number. Already we have the email. Then we can just say just location. Yeah. If we want to say state, we can just uh, copy all the states, uh, list of states in Nigeria. So, okay. Let's just do it like this. Because of time, we don't have time to sort out anything. We'll just copy all this. Then we'll come to our form. I've copied it. They say location or state. Then you come to this, this is a short answer, you say drop down. Put on the first one and just paste and all your states will drop. You understand me? So you will see how the drop down looks like. So the next thing we want to go to now is uh, another section. Start, start test. Okay, so now. The next thing will add question to it. If you see there's something we are doing wrong here, if you notice that this point is reading, so we'll go back to the first one, which is name, and we'll edit here to see zero points. Okay? This has dropped to 12. Go to the next one, phone number, edit here to see zero point. Let's drop to eight. I come here, click here to say zero points. Let's drop to four. And this is the last one here, zero point. So this one, our point counting can start from here. <laughs> the question is that we did just 10 questions. I want to make it over 100 so that each one should be 10. So click here. 
I make this one ten, and that's all. So first question is that: What is the capital of Nasarawa State? Of course, we we'll just make it very simple. Lafia, Makodi, Jos. Akwanga. So let's make it 20 so that we can save some time. Make it 20 marks. So, this, so that then we just have only five questions. Okay? So now you have to select the correct answer. I will see the correct answer here is uh, sorry. The correct answer here is Lafia. You click done. Okay, you can see it has been ticked. You are saying it ticked, but the student will not say it ticked. We'll come here and say, okay, shuffle option order. So my I'll shuffle the question order at the setting, which means my number one is your number two. Then even my number, even the same question, both of us will be answering. My the correct answer for me will be A, but the correct answer for you will be P. But of course it's Lafia. Okay, let's duplicate this and set the next question. What is the capital of Benue State? We just need to do this first so that we don't waste more time. Benue State. Put Makodi Lafia. So we'll go back to this and set it as Makodi and it has changed. Done. You can see we can also shift the option of option like this. So for it like this, just hold it down and pull it. Go to the next one. Yeah. What is the capital of uh, Plateau State? Plateau to state. This is basically geography like this. We'll come here and say just. Then remove this one from a colleague. Click on it and it will just go. So we have 60 questions. We have two more to go. Then let's see. Who is the FCT minister? So if because of time, we'll just say wiki. Yeah, we'll say, if you see, I duplicated this and I put my answer, the correct answer on the correct marking. So I don't need to go back and set it. Here we'll say, Tinobu. Here we'll say, uh, Rufus. And here we'll say, Fubara. Okay. Now the correct answer is wiki. We can leave it here or we can just move it down here. But remember, we'll shuffle the, the question order so it will change. Now it is 80. We have one more to go. Then we'll go here and say, who is the, how many countries do we have in Africa? Say 20, 30, 10, and 54. Okay, so now we'll put another section. Remember what I told you about section under like this and say, Thanks for taking this test. Then, okay. We can also add a video. Just click here, then click here to add a video. So all I just need to do is come here and then. Uh, okay. I'm looking for your full for line. Okay. So this is your video. Let me use this link. I'll come here. I've copied the link. I'll paste the link here. Okay. So I've set for it, and this is it. So I'll just click on insert. 
So the video is going to be here. Then I can also come here and make it stay in the center. You so also you can also attach a picture. Your timing. So you can go to the desktop, click here, browse, go to desktop, and then put this picture as attention, for instance. That's come. So you click on it to pull it down from the center, just like the way we did in post time I wore. So you see all of them have similar whatever, then you put it and it comes to the center. So you have a video and a picture to your question and all that. People can you can also set it in such a way that your students can attach documents. Like here, you just say attach file upload. So upload your score. So those are the things. So our test is ready. And I want to send you the link. If you want to send the link to the student, just click here, send. Bring this out. Click on this link. Shorten the link. Copy it. And I'm bringing it down to your class. So I'm going to send you the link. I want. OK. So I'm going to post the link here for everybody, please. Can you see the link? Please click on the link and fill the form. Can you see the link? Just type yes if you can see it. Yes, OK. Just click on it, please. As you are clicking it, be responding to the questions. Then we'll go back there as you are responding. As you are clicking and sending your score, please just um, watch the screen to see your scores dropping. So let's see the first person that will, first of all, first to finish the test. Secondly, those that will pass the test. And let's see if you can see your score. But your score will show here. No? But also check if you are going to see your score there. So we are waiting for the first. It's just five questions. That's the link. Okay. That's the link. You can't miss the link. So I'm saving it several times so that you don't miss it. Who is the first person who's going to respond first and is going to pass? Everybody just watch the screen as we are saying, oh, wow. Anatu Ajay Gena is the first person, 100 over 100. Wow, that's good. Ibrahim Ramadan. Excellent. So I think you can see how it works. Young, young cats. Yankat, okay. I hope that email you use is correct. Yankat, Miri Madaki, okay. State, you are from Plato State, okay. So that is how it works. So others, I'm sure others will soon start submitting too. Okay, others are submitting now. So let's go back to the form and see something while you are doing your test. Did you watch the video? Did you watch the video? Were you able to watch the video? Were you able to see the picture? And um, if you come to the responses, you will see the percentages, the graph, and everything. The 
you can see. So you can also actually ask questions as a surveyor, as a surveyor, sorry, and you come back here and see the response to those questions. You see the percentage of those that said it is George, see the percentage of those that said, uh, who is the SCT minister, the percentage of those that said it is Wiki. Some people are probably would have said Tinobu. You know, you see all those representations there. So you don't need to go somewhere and be looking for, for whatever. You can see the graphics moving and people are responding, it's moving. You see, the graph is moving. Okay. And you can also stop people from responding by clicking this. But let me so that they can continue responding. See, this I do that I've done the test so far. So your names, the percentage of those that says uh, this green is what Nasarawa, okay. So majority of you are actually from Nasarawa. Fifty-four percent of you are from Nasarawa. Why? Somebody is from Imo. Cross River, we have people from Cross River, FCT, Abuja, then Plateau. So you can see how good this is. Huh? <laughs> okay, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we have come to the end of this training tonight. Tomorrow will be a moment where we'll be giving you assignments to do. Please carry out your assignments. We'll be sending SMS to, I'm sure you got SMS today. Uh, take every moment very serious. From what you've just done now, you can see that it wasn't a, it wasn't something you're supposed to joke about. And um, ours is just to offer you this. Yours is to accept it and use it. And I'm sure by now some of us are already thinking of something else. Who has an idea is thinking about already with what he has learned now this night. Remember, you can perfect yourself by just going back to watch all these videos. And by the way, I will send this to the class. Who has an idea? Who is having new ideas? Yes, Engineer Jacob, A. Oga. Yes, who is having a, a new idea? Who is thinking about something new that he has never thought about before? Who is beginning to think about something? You now have your logo. You, have, you can do your flyer. You can have your Google Drive. Oh, Anna, yes, very good. Yes, very good. I know most people are not responding because they are very busy with their phone. Okay. I'm sure you want to see your name. Uh, this is your name here. He said only 17 of you have done it so far. And so far, almost everybody have 100 over 100. Wow. Very intelligent set of very beautiful class. That's good. So, okay, thank you. Yes, make research easy. I'm sure you're a lecturer, see via Arab. So you can now do your research very simple. You can have people responding to your research in Kano, Canada, in Brazil. Once they have your link, that's it. Okay, Abubakar Dan, Dan Yarima, you want to say something? Please unmute yourself, Abubakar. Unmute yourself. Uh, good evening, sir. Good evening. How well, how everything, sir? But I just entered late. Okay. But I achieved something very very important today. Thank you. How to 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 do something on Google. Mm. So mm. I appreciate sir. Thank you. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. Yes, even though you came late, like I said, yes. the video is going to be posted of this recording. Okay. Then I also posted okay. videos of the one we've done before that is even more detailed. So just take your time. Within two hours, you are through with all these videos. They will start practicing okay. and you become a guru. Okay. Yes. Maybe the next time you'll be the one to come and teach us. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate it, sir. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, and and Balaga. Yes, you want to say something? 
Okay. I think she was just uh, appreciating us. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to say good night. Uh, and Balaga, you want to say something? Or mute yourself, please, so that we can listen to you and close the class. Okay. So, thank you all. Uh, stay blessed. See you in class. And Balaga, are you with us? Are you trying to say something? Or mute yourself. Okay. No, please, it's not that my network is bad. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> thank okay. you. Okay. So, thank you all, ladies and gentlemen. See you in class tomorrow. I'll send a link to for you to go and try your poster my word this night. I'll send it to the class. Then watch out for events. On my part, I'll be sending you SMS to remind you about the class so that you can go back and check for updates in the class. Thank you, Master Bless. Thank you. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, thank Good night. You. Good night. Good night. Thank you, sir. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.